Hi, I'm John, and today I'm going to be talking about Crow Translate. It's a nice little translation program that I found in the Discover Software Center of my KDE Plasma desktop, and I use Kubuntu Linux. I've got the latest version, which is um, 23.04, and, uh, you know, it, it's been a really great uh, transition to Kubuntu. I really like it, and uh, I have discovered more and more software in the Discover Center than probably any other uh, type of software uh, center within different uh, versions of Linux. So let's take a look at Crow Translate. Uh, here it is. Very simple, very easy. What it does is you see down here, it just grabs from different translation engines, whether it's Google, Yandex, Bing, Libre Translate and Lingva. I don't know what Lingva is, but maybe uh, somebody out there might find it useful. Who knows? So anyway, it'll auto detect the uh, the language. Here I've got some Japanese, and then all you do uh, is make sure that you have uh, a current language set up. Uh, you know, it could be anything, and. Uh, in this case, I have English, and uh, you know it could be any number of things that you may want to translate it to. Um, so let's translate it. You hit this button in the middle, and there it gives you the translation. Real simple, real easy. Now, uh, let's just take a look at some of the settings that it has. Uh, let, me, let me talk about a couple of things that it does. You can use this tool here. It'll recognize a screen area. So it'll do uh, OCR, uh, optical character recognition, and then translate it for you. Or you can copy uh, text from wherever. Uh, uh, you can copy things to and from the clipboard. And then also you will also see this uh, play button here, which will give you, um, you know, the translation spoken to you. So pretty simple, pretty easy, but... I like using something like this more than I do something like uh, the actual uh, uh, websites uh, for the Google Translate or the Bing Translate because invariably if I start saying that I want to talk in Spanish, uh, it's going to say, well, are you taking a trip to Mexico? Uh, let's show you some ads about vacation destinations. Well, I'm not interested in that. I don't want that. So, in fact, let's do something a little bit different. Uh, let's do um, just some translation. Uh, let's paste in some pickup lines. How's that? And let's just see if we can hear what it says. Oh, uh, English is not supported for Google. Let's see. Okay, let's, um, that doesn't really do it on that side. So let's do it for the translation. So let's translate this, oh, because I have it on English and English. So let's translate this into Spanish. So we're going to pull that up because I'm always trying to bone up on the Spanish. I, I want to be better at it because I go to Mexico now and again. Um, so I'm going to highlight Spanish. There, I did that, and now let's hit the translate button, and let's hit the uh, speak pause. Voy a tener que pedirte que te vayas. Estás haciendo quedar mal a las otras chicas. Okay, so there you go. That's what it's doing. Nothing, you know, earth-shattering about it, nothing new. But this will take care of just about anything you want to do without having to go to those websites and do that. I would see this as a better tool for me also just to um, you know, brush up on Spanish, get it a little bit better, use some common uh, sayings or some conversational stuff that I could learn and repeat. Uh, I think this is even better. You know, some people go through a Spanish language course or French or something, whatever it might be. I, I think this makes more sense because it's free and you can, you know, really talk in just about any way that you want and really get to learn the language just by speaking it without having to buy something. So 
Uh, let's take a look at another pickup line. Let's see if we got another goodie. Uh, let's see. Really bad. These are really bad. <laughs> okay, my buddies bet me that I wouldn't be able to start a conversation with the hottest person in the bar. Want to buy some drinks with their money? And there's the translation. So let's hear it. Mis amigos me apostaron que no sería capaz de iniciar una conversación con la persona más atractiva del bar. ¿Quieres comprar algunas bebidas con su dinero? So yeah, it does a good job. And uh, I like it. And uh, I can practice my Spanish. And that's, that's kind of my thing. So it does do the OCR. So you can copy uh, with this tool. It looks like a crop tool, but I think it'll go into any, uh, any type of uh, web page or something like that, or a document, something like that. And you could do that. Probably best to copy text if possible. Probably better than, than OCR. Uh, that's where I think sometimes things can get a little uh, messed up, that type of thing. Uh, any other quick pickup lines? Oh, yeah, this is a good one. How's that? Let's see. Hi, I'm Mr. Wright. Somebody said you were looking for me. So let's translate that. Hola, soy... <laughs> Hola, soy el señor correcto. I'll go in... Uh, I'll, I can't even do that one. Uh, dijo que me estabas buscando. Uh, I love uh, Mr. Wright, how it translates to uh, uh, señor correcto. I'm going to be señor correcto. I like that. Anyway, it's, an, it's a nice little program. Nothing special, but it doesn't have to be. And that's the thing about discovering new software, uh, especially when it's, it's free and open software. And uh, I find it in my Discovery Software Center uh, in KDE Plasma. It has more software than I think almost anything, and I think the quality of the software is really good. Not like some programs that are just thrown in there just to say we've got tens of thousands of programs, but something that uh, solves a unique need. Once again, I don't like to use the web translators unless I was on vacation somewhere where I didn't have access to, to this, and uh, I, I just needed an internet connection, something like that. That's been very helpful when I travel, and a lot of you have have done the same thing. But for a desktop, when you're trying to just do emails translation um, or maybe a text translation, I've had that too. Uh, it's really nice to be able to use. And I'm going to use it for, uh, for just, uh, you know, really getting better again at my Spanish, which I'm not fluent in at all. Uh, but, you know, I can listen to it and I know what people are saying, basically but uh, not uh, very good specifically. It's enough that I can understand kind of what's being said. Uh, but I want to become more fluent in it, and really every day, especially when I go down to Mexico, I like to be able to use the language, and I try to every chance I get. So um, great place to visit. Uh, people are great. Uh, not everything you read in the news is, is bad. There's some things up on the border, obviously, that are a problem. Uh, but uh, in other places, uh, you know, the people are, are real nice. And I'd like to be able to speak the language of the places I go, if possible. And uh, that's what's great about all this translation software these days. But I like Crow Translate for its simplicity, its accessing of different engines. You will find that the translations are slightly different uh, from one uh, engine to another. Uh, this one I kind of messed up. Let's see what Yandex does with it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, hola, soy el señor correcto. It does the same thing. And it's basically the same translation. Sometimes these translations will be a little bit different, but that has to do with the engine that you're getting off the website, whether they're using uh, Google, Bing, Yandex, whatever it might be. Um, anyway, that's, that's really it for today. Uh, Crow Translate, give it a shot uh, just for uh, brushing up on Spanish, and uh, 
If you're like me, or it could be another language, could be French, could be all sorts of different ones, and uh, just a simple package, easy to use, and I'm going to use this uh, to get better at, uh, at my second language, which is Spanish, and uh, I'm lousy at it, and I'd really like to get better at it. So anyway, I hope you have a great day, and uh, we'll talk to you again soon, and uh, take it easy. Bye-bye.